Welcome back, and today I'm reviewing the Le Meridian Chicago Oak Brook Center Hotel. This is the Executive Suite One King Room. I was upgraded to this room, um, originally booked a king room, was upgraded via the chat, which is available about 48 hours before you stay uh, at the hotels in the uh, Marriott Bonvoy app. Here is the breakfast menu selection, which is an option. They are serving breakfast, um, so you can choose breakfast or points. I'm a titanium elite. I did not choose the breakfast, but I just wanted to get the menu just so you could know what to expect. So. My guess is you can choose, um, as far as the signature breakfast goes, I believe you can choose one of those options there. Um, but I didn't go down there to actually look at the options. Again, I didn't have breakfast there. There are a lot of dining options right around as Oak Brook Center. I mean, essentially a mall really right across the parking lot from uh, this hotel. So there's a lot of outside options to eat from right uh, right there and here's the room room 526 and this was uh the executive suite and they say on the website it's about 646 square feet and like i said there was plenty of uh plenty of space uh in the room uh one thing you'll see coming up in the video is that now this did have a refrigerator and a microwave um yeah, it looks a little out of place, so I'm guessing they probably just put these in here in the suites. As, yeah, I've never seen the Le Meridian that actually has a, I guess, a refrigerator and a microwave built in as part of the decor. I mean, this is just a, uh, yeah, microwave and refrigerator they probably just put in the suites. Um, I guess to give it a more homely feel. I, I certainly appreciate it, even though it looks tacky. But yeah, I do like putting things, being able to put things in a refrigerator and use the microwave on uh, longer stays. There's the Wonders of the World book out on the living room table. And I'll tell you, the contrasting decor in this hotel versus uh, the Drake Oakbrook autograph collection hotel that I stayed at which had very dark tones, but this one was um, yeah, very, very bright, felt felt more lively after being in the uh, dark tone <laughs> room there. And here's my view from the living room, which you're looking at a couple buildings right at the double tree over there. Uh, one thing I did find interesting is that the they had the Bose surround sound hooked up to the television, which is different. I don't see that a lot in uh, hotels that have this around sound. I guess it's a nice nice touch if you want to watch a uh, a movie and feel like you're in the movie, I suppose. Here's the uh the bedroom area. The king bed uh yeah, it's pretty comfortable the table with another TV and um, it did have charge ports here next to the TV so that's always a plus uh, I always say the more charge ports the better especially this day and age when you're carrying multiple devices it's convenient uh, to have that here's the closet area and nothing too special there the safe if you need it Here's my window view there, pretty much the same as in the uh, living room. Now this room didn't, uh, well, they did and didn't. Um, as you can see, there's no direct charging point like on the lamp or anything, but again, it's more for the clock. Well, not inconvenient totally, but yeah, just it, it baffles me that many hotels nowadays still don't have um, charge ports by the bed because on that side, there wasn't one at all. So makes for inconvenience if there's two of you <laughs> to charge your devices, I guess, and have them right by your side. And the bathroom here had a you know, standalone uh, sit-down tub and the walk-in shower, the Madeline and Goats toiletries, which I do enjoy. And I did swipe that soap from my own uh, hotel soap collection. And the walk-in shower, I always want to see, is it going to get water all over the floor after you're done using it. And this one, 
a little bit seeped out, but again, it's, it wasn't the worst though. I've, I've experienced way worse as far as that goes. Um, now beyond breakfast being served and that portion of the hotel being open for people to actually eat in it, the gym is also open. The gym is open 24 seven. As you can see, it's a pretty standard gym. You had a couple Peloton bikes, some sit down bikes, ellipticals, and treadmills, some bells there got free weights is yeah multiple and kind of an all-in-one system there pull-ups and things like that so pretty standard gym fare gym equipment here at this hotel and this is accessible 24 7 uh, with key card entry to the gym uh, but overall uh, pretty good stay as far as the location goes it's very conveniently located if you want to shop right across from the oak brook center plenty of dining options right around there so i guess i can't imagine that you why you may want to eat at the hotel with plenty of options around you so um again a nice uh location there it's convenient to that and convenient to the highway as well 88 is right uh right there down the street so pretty easy to get anywhere in the Chicago with this. Hope you enjoyed the review. Uh, hit the like button if you did, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.